And we're off. Goodbye, planes. Huh? There's a goblin camp right there. This whole time? Hold up. There's going to be tons of black metal there. Yo, we're going back. So I think what we're going to do is build the artisan table. So I believe I only just need 10 wood and 2 dragon tears. So let's take those out. We'll put those here. Uh, still need to hang the motor trophy. Haven't done that yet either. Probably do that here pretty soon. I think I'm going to put the artisan table right here somewhere. I mean, why not right here just like this? Looks good. Blast furnace, windmill, and a spinning wheel. What does that make? Blast furnace and the spinning wheel. Leather scraps. Five leather scraps, ten iron nails, twenty fine wood. Ooh. Iron nails, thirty. Thirty. So a total of forty. Total of forty iron nails to make these. Let's see if we have some iron saved up. I probably used all of that too. Probably used up all my iron and I have. I am completely broke for metals. I'm gonna have to make trips everywhere to the swamp and yeah, we don't have any more metals. Okay. I'm gonna have to make trips to the swamp for iron. Can't craft or upgrade anything. But it looks cool, it's there. And then let's see, can we preview the spinning wheel? Yeah, just somewhere like that. Oh, you fill it up on that side and then it comes out the other side. So we'll probably just put that guy somewhere right here. Just like that. Um, but I'm going to need iron nails to make it. Which means I'm going to have to make a trip to the swamp. If I want to do those. Let's see, there's a swamp close to us. Yeah, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to go sailing, go on a sailing expedition and get some of those, uh, get some of that. But I think before we get to that, I'm gonna make a garden and I'm gonna get this barley going. So probably put a garden, build a house here. Um, it's already on a hill. I need feathers. Let me get this guy. Oh, he flew away. He saw me shooting at him. Yeah, so I think I'll dig out. I want to make a pretty big farm right here. And then I want to mow it out so it doesn't get bothered. let just make this whole thing a farm.
So here we are in the plains biome where I made a little garden. I wanted to get the barley and the flax going. Uh, looks like it's ready to pick up, so let's do that. Learned a little trick. If I uh, press Q and then hold E, it'll just walk and pick. Look at that. So nice. Only holding E right now. And then press Q again. And look in a different direction. And it'll kind of readjust like that. And then I just keep the crosshair right on the flax and it'll pick it up. Yeah. So just hold an E, cruise in here, picking up all our flax. All right. We'll just go this way and pick up a little bit here. You know, I'm really thinking to get to the next level of armor, we're going to have to just replant. Like, I don't think this is going to be enough. I think it takes a lot of this. And in order to put the uh, windmill down and the spinning wheel to make the next set of armor, I've got to have iron. Which is the reason we're going to bring our ship over here. And hopefully there's some crypts. Hopefully there's some crypts right over there. I don't know if you can see those swamps. But I think I'm going to bring the little boat out just to sail across back and forth. And then we'll go from go from there. All right, time to implement our plan. There's a crypt right across there. So we're going to put down our crafting bench real quick right here. Doesn't have to be great looking. But just so we can drop our boat here. This, yeah, we'll go ahead and face it that way. Um, yeah, here we go. And then we'll just jump in and sell across. I probably should push it off a little bit. Let's just push it away. There's only a ladder on one side on this guy. I guess. All right, here we go. We're just going to sail straight across. We'll probably gra grab some certain cores while we're over here from the little spawner dudes. Check this crypt out. Man, I haven't been in a crypt in a minute. Let's make sure we mark it on the map. To oh, you know what I just realized? You need the swamp key to go in the crypts. Turning the boat around. Going to get a swamp key. Let's sail to the swamps. Right across the street. Uh, I'm going to go this way. Probably less stuff. Spawning in. Trying to mess with this this way. And now we're wet. Uh, yeah, I'm going to eat the carrot soup. I want more stamina while we're over here. And now that it's clear and it's daytime, I can see pretty well over at the swamp. And that's just like a little place for everybody to chill and talk about swampy things. And But right over there is the crypt. And that's where we're going. We got our tailwind. Still need to put our motor trophy up. Oh, what a nice day in the swamp. Oh, look at this. This is perfect. Oh, dude, there's ooze and all kind of stuff right here. All right, well... Let's run. Let's go to try to sneak attack from the back. Yeah, I know this this Uzi blob. Oh, okay. Frostner's pretty strong against him. Yeah. Yeah. That's what's up, man. Whoa. Hey, leech. Uh. I don't want you destroying my boat while I'm going. Okay, we Viking raided and cleared that up real quick. I heard somebody shoot an arrow at us. Oh, well. All right, we're using our swamp key. Going in the sunken crypt. I'm going to put this guy on and see if it helps. See if we can see better. 
haven't been in a crypt in a while. Check it out. Yeah. All right. We'll just start here. Mining away. Uh, the light helps a little bit. Yeah, yeah, scrap iron. That's what we want. I'll see you on the other side there, Draugr. Can you get through? Or I'll make you a path. Oh, it's an elite. I'll stun him. Uppercut. Oh, we one-shotted the elite with the uppercut. Stun and uppercut for the win. Yeah. Oh, there's the spawn pile. Yeah, get out of here. Yeah, we're OP now. Oh, look at that 11 right away. That's what we need. There's a lot of dudes in here. And they're all trying to get me. All right. Don't forget, we still got a block, even though we're super OP now and amazing. How did... I'm hit. There we go. Come here, elitist. Yeah? Oh, that made us miss. All right, let's just block him. Oh, look at his face. Yeah? Bye-bye. All right, now I got room to come in. Oh, you're going to come to me? A little frost near action for your face. Oh, yeah, you got me. Uppercut for you. And I got a present for you, too. Oh, that didn't kill him. This will. We've cleared the room out. And now all of these beautiful treasures are our... No, iron. Lame. Oh, sneaky pants. Hello. Oh, there's a spawner here. I didn't even realize it. There we go. Got them all. Cleared the room out. No problem anymore. I used to die all the time in this situation. And now I don't. This looks like a good spot. Yeah, it's right there. Yeah, we'll just pull in. Oh, you're trying to attack me while I'm sailing my ship, huh? Can I just run over you and kill you? Oh, it doesn't work like that. All right, let's get out. Viking raid, here we go. Big attacks on everybody. Boom, the other ones are still in the water. Let's go. Let's go, skeleton. Yeah, where's that Draugr at? Okay, I'm not even going to let you get a hit in. Not going to let you get a single hit. You know why? Because I'm going to stun you, and then I'm going to uppercut. Oh, yeah, so nice. So nice and smooth. All right, you can come over here, too. I see you, leech. Oh, oh, you got a hit in. You sneaky dog. Yeah, you're done. You're done. Get out of here. Go home. Today wasn't your day. Today was my day. Look, so there's another crypt. And here's a crypt. So by the time I'm done with this, we should have tons of iron. All right, we're checking out of the swamp. Both our pickaxes broke. Not really much else we can do there without the pickaxes. So we're going to sail back to the house. Repair our pickaxes. Reset our rested buff. Sleep. Get rid of the cold drain. And then make do, just do another round. Rinse and repeat. All right, check it out. So I got our flax and our barley planted. And we'll do that again probably one more time. It should be good. It should be grown by the time we get back. But one thing I want to do before we sell back with all of our awesome and amazing iron is I want to put our motor trophy up. Because if we put the motor trophy up, then we can sell back with a tailwind. Hopefully that lasts the whole way. I'm not entirely sure how long it lasts, but we'll try it out. We'll see what it's like. I earned that motor trophy. Yeah, this is the one. We're here. Let's hang our motor trophy up. See how cool it looks. Is this it? Kind of looks like him. No, that looks like the other guy. This looks like a dragon. 
This is a sacrificial stone for motor. Yeah, let's throw it up. Ooh, cool. Wow, I actually like his trophy. Uh, I have an idea. Yeah, we're going to activate motor because I want to try it out. But I had a thought. I'm about to share it with you. Uh, we can't read the sacrificial stone. It doesn't tell us what. Yeah. Oh, yeah, let's read it. Black wings across the moon and sun. Down from the mountain our mother comes. Her weeping tears will fall like rain. Her voice will call us home again. Cool. Very poetic. I like that. So, uh, oh, okay. Well, my idea is not going to work. I was thinking we could just keep them in the house and we could use them uh, whenever we wanted to. But we could keep them up like trophies and they'd look really cool in the house. Yeah, I know what bone mass does. But that's weird. I can't, I can't take them off of there. I guess once you put them up there, they're there. Okay, weird. Oh, that's pretty cool. That looks pretty neat. 3D. And then back to the plains biome to grab our stuff. Grab our metal. Grab our black metal. Grab our iron. Grab our ship. Christen the ship. Drop it right on our head. Push it in the water. Yeah. That should be good. Here we go. Grab eight. Can we carry that? Can we split this stack? Can we carry that? Split it again. Can we carry that? We can. Let's take this. Oh, almost jumped right into those. Look at those goblins. Yeah, you're trying to roll up on my base, but guess what? I got a moat. And my moat works. And I think, yeah, fall in the moat. Uh, Am I using wooden arrows on these dudes? I think I am. And it's working. Uh, I'm just going to jump over there and smash him in the face. Oh, are you running? Are you scared? You brought back up, huh? That's okay. Oh, it's an endless army. They're doing a Viking raid on me. I do the Viking raids around here, fellas. Bye, baby Yoda. Goodbye. Oh, and this other one's helpless. Oh, he's helpless. He's stuck down there. Oh, are you so angry? Are you an angry baby Yoda? Yeah. Yeah, have fun. I'm going to leave you there. You're going to be my pet. Let's get on the open ocean. Let's go. We're sailing. Don't get stuck. Don't hit anything. I got all our stuff, our black metal. We need to go this way. Which is this way. And we're off. Goodbye, planes. Huh? There's a goblin camp right there. This whole time? Hold up. There's going to be tons of black metal there. Yo, we're going back. Okay. We're here. We're at the goblin camp. Um, I'm just going to stay up here and pick them off. 40 arrows. That's not a lot. But let's see if we can hide. Go back in sneak mode. That worked. All right. Use our in-your-face tactic. Hold on. Before you get involved. Let me get rid of this guy. Uh, I guess you're stronger than me, too. No, you're not. Boom. All right. And the day turned misty again. Oh. Okay, we're pushing in a little deeper. 
getting closer to the middle. It's hard to see what else is in here. Oh, I see a guy over here. Oh, another spear guy right there. Hey, can I get... Oh, man. This dude saw me. Spear guy saw me. It's just him. We're all right. Yeah. Yeah, he's freezing him. He can't move. Yeah, can't move, son. See ya. That looks like mostly everything. Yeah. I don't I don't want to risk it. I don't want to push it. We've been very successful. Leave that one star baby Yoda over there. And then let's go collect up whatever else is on the ground over here. And let's get out. Let's get out of here. Okay. We've reached the shore. To the other side. To our original plains biome here. Um, transfer our black metal to our Viking longship. Oh yeah, looks good to add more. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, we're too heavy. We'll just get it close and then split it if we have to. Can I get close enough here? Yes, we can. Throw that in there. All right, looks a little better. Got a little bit more now. Now we got uh, 30, 60, 90, 120, 150, and then same thing here. Yeah, that looks good. The second I turn the ship facing this direction, we got a headwind. You know what that means. It's motor time. Time to do the motor. Can we hold fast and do motor? Motor time. Let the... Let the... Nope. Can't do it that way. But we can do it. Oh, wait. We can do it. This way. Oh, help us, Motor and Odin, to sail fast across the ocean. Here we go. Kicking it into overdrive. Full speed ahead. Check us out. We made it here. To Salty's portal. This is where we get all our silver from. Which worked out great because I was able to grab the silver out of the bins that we had. So now I'm going to sail through here. We're going to cut through here. Then we're going to go up this little channel right there. And then we'll be back at the house. And then it's just straight smelting duty after that. But that's where we're at right now. And then if you look, if you're interested and you really want to see, I will share with you this right here look at that look at that look at that look at all that silver oh man 30 60 almost 90 silver a ton of iron some black metal and even 310 we will take it all let's make sure the ship is in good condition can we repair it mm, let's just put a crafting station down real quick can't let anything happen to this mother load It'd be like the santa maria or something getting sunk with all the treasure on it all the king's treasure why can't yeah there we go we're fixed i don't know that that ship is an actual reference but that's the one i used and we'll push our ship out into the water or we'll swim underneath she might just be good to go it was good to sail like that give her a little push boom jump on top here we go we've got control of our viking longship that is full and full of treasures. Uh, not to jinx myself, but if anything happens to the ship on the trip back, I will lose my mind. What do you think, guys? Do you think we can make it through this channel? I, I don't even know that I'd call this a channel. This is like a creek. Check it out. We're going to go through a creek right here. With our life savings in our ship. I feel like we can do it. Can we see if we get in close? Not so much. Let's try it out. Hey, check it out. There's my first house. It's the very first thing I built in this game. I didn't know what was going on. Oh, we hit some rocks. Or, yeah, no, that was rocks. Check it out, though. It looks nice. 
Look at that. That was us in the very beginning. Oh, big hit. Uh, maybe we'll raise the mass so we can see a little better. I'll we'll use our Tokyo Drift skills here. To kind of drift through, slide through. Got to use our pro boating skills. Here we go. It's a little sketchy. We're doing it though. We're blasting through. We're coming out the other side. Full speed ahead. And we're home. Check it out. Oh, jeez. Oh. Oh no! We sunk our ship! Can we get our cargo? No way! No way! Go away, Neck! <laughs> oh, this never stops happening. Ew. Look at our sunken ship. Yeah, it's our cargo. That's what we want. Uh, so I've got the hoe on me now. Let's go run grab. Hopefully it's still there when we come back. We were so close to making it all the way. Let's go in and uh, let's grab some stone. I got a plan. All right, so here's the plan. We're going to take some stone and we're going to raise the ground to our cargo or at least close to our cargo so that we can make multiple trips coming back with it. Now, if I get on the corner of this and look down, yeah, we're going to make a path to our cargo. Uh, yeah, 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 one more. Now, can I just grab it if I put this away? I can. Take all. I know we're going to be encumbered. So what we're going to do is just throw it. We got to get it out of the water. The wreck in our ship wasn't such a bad thing. I smoothed out the land right here in front of the house. And then, I, oh, we need to get the steer. Can we get him through the door? We got him. So I smoothed out the land right here. Check it out. It's pretty smooth. And then I cleared this out a little bit. I was going to put new smelters and kilns down here. But I think it's going to look so much better up here. And be so much more convenient. Because then we can just run here, run here, come out here. And then boom, 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 boom. Do all our smelting. But I also had another really good idea when I was trying to figure out how to get rid of... Or how to get all of our metal back up to the top. We've got a cart. Let's put our stuff in the cart. Look at this. Take all of that at once. And transfer all of this at once. Check it out. Smart. One trip. All the metal. Yeah. That's everything. Uh, oh. I still got some in here. Okay. And then. So just to show you guys. And i uh, Obviously, you need to clean this up a little bit. That's a little crazy looking. Yeah, all of the cargo was picked up. I don't see any missing. You see some missing, or it looks like I'm missing some. Leave a comment below. We'll, we'll come back and find it. And that's going to wrap it up for this episode. I enjoyed hanging out with everybody today. I uh, hope you enjoyed building a flax farm together grabbing some iron from the crypts bringing it all the way back wrecking our long ship coming up through the channel through the little creek here and if you did enjoy it and you want to see more episodes show your support subscribe smash the thumbs up ring the bell notification below and thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed our playthrough stay tuned for more epic valheim episodes and what's going on with this fish What's going on, buddy? You just hanging out? You just hanging out here? You enjoying the view? Are you sun tanning? Is that what's happening? All right. Well, it's a nice day. 
So I don't blame you. But anywho, hope everybody had a good day and uh, see you next time.